Today in our Impact 5 report on autism, connecting the pieces, we take a look at a new facility that will be opening in a little more than a year. It is like any other in our area for those on the autism spectrum, and it's being developed by a family best known in the world of sports. You probably know him for his easy golf swing. But now, Ernie Els, along with his wife, Liesel, will also be known for something else. Oh, it's, it's unbelievable. At a groundbreaking ceremony in Jupiter, they showed the plans for the Els Center for Excellence. It will be the first of its kind school featuring classrooms, athletic facilities, and medical programs for those from ages 3 to 21 on the autism spectrum. When our son was diagnosed and when we moved here, it became evident that there was this huge gap that we needed to fill. And for us to be able to be a small contribution to that and, and help the kids and help the future is amazing. Ben is their 12-year-old son who was diagnosed with autism when he was four. Through him, they saw the need for more facilities. We never thought our lives would uh, go this way. Thanks to Ben, we, we are where we are today. With his golf connections leading the way, they've raised 15 of the $30 million it will cost to build the entire facility. They expect to have the first stage open in 2015 for younger students. It will have room for 300. But they're also looking to connect with the international autism community. And we're hoping that we can reach far away places where there aren't facilities like these and share information with parents and teachers and help them teach the kids in their communities. Getting this far is a milestone, but how does it compare with playing on the PGA Tour? <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> no, this, this is much more fun. You know, this is, um, this is hard work, but it's, it's fun. So much fun that El says he expects to spend a lot more time at the center when his golf playing days are over.